All right, everyone, what's going on? Welcome back to City Skylines. This will be episode 23 of our Let's Play. Uh, welcome back to New Ungrateful. Uh, greetings from basically Newfoundland, I guess you could call it. Um, I guess we should probably go ahead and uh, should probably mark some of this area as the Newfoundland district. So let's go ahead and we'll actually do that for a second here uh, here we will make this area over here Newfoundland because why not the newfound land of ungrateful ass motherfuckers who clearly I don't even know they just they're being ungrateful whether or not they you know whether they're being ungrateful or they're not you know they're ungrateful for what they have, and, uh, yeah. So, with that being said, and I know you guys probably got some sort of weird counter on how many times I've said, uh, so with that being said, uh, here we go. Get ourselves, and there we are. Poplar Square. I think this would be, uh, Newfoundland, definitely. New... Foundland. I guess we'll we'll call it that. Newfoundland. Yeah. All right. So what's going on here at the stadium? Are these guys in session right now? Uh, they're operating normally. Uh, it offers entertainment to the masses. Of course, it fucking does. Uh, it's got 22 terrorists vis visiting last week, and about 11 more terrorists um, visiting last week as well. Who knows what they're doing on that field there. They're probably testing out like IEDs and fucking explosives and shit. Meanwhile, what do we got over here? We got a massive traffic jam just going on through here. Jesus Christ. Oh man. These guys... Let's see what's going on here. Hmm. Got a lot of traffic going on here. I think these guys definitely need the right of way uh, going off the bridge. So, Gray Bridge gets the right of way at the junction. I definitely think. You know what? These guys get the right of way too. Uh, those guys have to stop because, of course, you know. Because why wouldn't they want to stop? You know? They got them brakes, they got their brakes you know, stuff like that. Anyway, uh, let's see what we got going on. So we don't have much need for anything. We don't have much demand for any of our services. Uh, so we should probably start making some bus routes around the area. We're doing okay on elementary schools. We're doing good on high schools as well. We're good on universities still, um, so yeah, I'm not gonna say it. Anyway, probably get a metro line going down here. Actually, now that I think about it, actually, you know what? Let's get let's get probably another bus line going, maybe around Florence Heights. So uh, we are going to probably put it in a spot where there we go. Yep where it kind of connects up, so, maybe get it, you know what, we're not even going to connect it up to that bus route, we're just going to connect it, uh, just in our own way, going to maybe, maybe get these guys their own, uh, bus lines and shit, because, you know, why not, alright, so, one of these guys has to go, maybe one by the by the mall. That would be perfect right there. Alrighty. Now we got a plane landing. A pink plane. I guess it's just color coded in pink. And then a metro right across from the cemetery. You know, just so that way people can get to work faster without the hassle of having to um, you know, having to lie to their boss about where they were. You know, I, I don't even know what they would be doing doing that shit. But, either way, get ourselves another one right over here. We destroy one business. Um, 
possibly maybe another one over here. And then one down here by the roundabout. I think that would work. There we are. So. Alright. Get it all connected up. That looks a little shitty, but shitty is my middle name. Yeah. Anyway. Let's get it kind of going through here. We should probably add one right over here by the bridge. I think that would look good. I mean, it probably won't look good, but who cares what the people think. Anyway, there we go. Kind of make the line curve a little bit. All right. And then they're, you know, if they want a bus line or they want any sort of transportation line uh, towards the uh, towards the expo center, then you know they're walking their fat asses. Uh, so it don't matter though. You know they can use the exercise. I plan on uh, going to. PAX East uh, next year. That'll be up in Boston. I'm not sure when exactly, but I believe it'll be in... Uh, should be... I guess in the... Uh, probably in March, if I'm correct. Um, but, you know... I'm not sure entirely if I'm gonna go yet. I'm gonna try to make it. Um... Got a lot of skyscrapers around here. This looks so nice. This is crazy. It looks kind of close, you know, kind of looks cluttered and kind of looks messy, but, you know, it's there. Alright, we're gonna empty, we're gonna start collecting shit from that uh, landfill site and maybe some more shit from that other landfill site. Um, let's see here. What these guys are complaining about. Not enough raw materials. Well, you get what you get. I guess you could say. Uh, we got plenty of skyscrapers. Or at least, these ain't even scraping the sky yet. Uh, you got the Giga Store, kind of blocking off some of the buildings from uh, from the rest. That would be nice, though, if, you, if I had just as simply uh, had some of the skyscrapers, or at least the high-density uh, buildings back here, and then all the low-density, maybe had some low-density spots right, right over there. Have some, like, boardwalk-looking-ass things going on. What are these people doing? There's a cruise ship, and then there's two... And then there's, yeah, two cargo ships and a damn cruise ship. Uh, that's carrying a hundred passengers. Man, it, it, for a second there, it kind of looked like the frickin' human centipede. I swear to God. I don't even know why I brought that up, but yeah. It, it uh... It looked like that. I seen I done seen it with my bone or yeah but with my fucking bone with my own eyes I don't know why it was bringing my ugh, I don't know why I was bringing in my bones <sighs> anyway anywho uh what else do we need to make our city great again uh the lilac residents citizens are sick do we have a hospital over here? We do not have a hospital. Oh wait, we we do. It just healthcare availability is good, but I I just don't get it. Isn't isn't it? Uh, well, these guys don't have. People are complaining over here that the health insurance is shit. Well, it's not really my problem now, is it? It's your own goddamn problem. Anyway ourselves the leisure and the unique buildings and shit that we really don't need they can they can live without all the stupid tourist attractions oh man all right city needs power oh yeah my ass they need power that was probably beforehand but either way up oh, there we go Let's see if they uh they're doing good on power still Let's see about now still doing good on power Yep, still doing damn good on power. Uh, here we go. Water availability is good, so we can bring that down a bit. Um, how's garbage collection? Garbage processing. We could up the thing on garbage a little bit. 
Why is it that we that we are kind of we we're losing money? I don't get why, but either way, um, we're at sixty-eight thousand people for a population. Um, gotta probably expand this little area down here into uh, maybe more offices just across the street, you know, for no particular reason. Um, definitely turn these guys kind of get their offices kind of straighten up you know because they're all looking I mean they don't really look messy but you know they they look weird got this accounting firm with a clown hat on top or with a clown head at least um, maybe get some offices down here and maybe some more residential down here because you know who doesn't want to have to who here would ever not want to listen to, you know, constant people just yelling about how much the other team sucks, you know, because I'm sure that'll be fun. Not sure why anyone else wouldn't find that fun to do, but it's quite alright. And then of course we can kind of bring it around like that. I don't know why I even say shit like that. It was weird. But, either way, got ourselves some spots for residential. And we're going to put it right near the stadium, too, because um, I think it would be nice to, you know, see, you know, if those guys actually turn into legitimate um, killers and stuff. They're like, oh, well, as a kid, I had to live with the sounds of people yelling at the other team. For no apparent reason. So, a lot of dead people over here. I don't get why. There's a little bit of smog. And I think it's because of the incineration plant. So, we are going to move it kind of like out here, give it its own kind of private road a bit, possibly. There we are. Alright, so. You know what? Actually, we're going to kind of curve that road out a little bit. Um, let's actually go ahead and we'll delete the road and make it nice and pretty. Bring it out like that. And then, of course, maybe get a thing right over there. Get a road. Alright, well, these guys are complaining. So before they start abandoning the ship... They're, they're going to want their stuff. There we go. Here we are. Oh, man. Work was fun. Oh, man. Because I, I work at a grocery store, and typically I'm out kind of like pushing shopping carts back into the store. Oh, my God. It is so freaking cold where we live. I mean, it's not, you know what well, we've had it's not like we haven't had cold weather before but you know when when it's 15 degrees outside you know you, you just kind of like sit there and uh yeah you're, you're just kind of wondering why the hell you deserve why you even picked that job in the first place but you know you need the money and uh yeah either way Got ourselves the massive bridge jam. I don't know what the hell is going on here. Everyone just looking to... We might need to just knock out part of this area and just build a freaking roundabout. Build a nice big roundabout. Right around here. Possibly. Um, do these guys get the right of way over here? I think these guys who are stopping at least on this big six lane road they need a uh, they need to stop for people of the uh, people that are traveling down gray street I thought that said gay street for a second I, I was like what the fuck yeah and gay street <laughs> wow got gray bridge seems like everything's starting to kind of it's not really doing too much good. It's because of those damn seaports and shit. Um, 
anyway, let's see where all these people go, though. I just, I'm kind of curious. Alright. But anyway, we could possibly build an elevated road. That's what we could do. We could probably, because this is kind of... They have to go up, too. Remember that, guys. They have to go up. So, I think what we're going to do is we are going to kind of get ourselves the bridge at an elevation. And we're going to kind of delete some of these guys all around here. Um, the fire station is going to need some access to the road. Uh, really don't want to have to knock down more than what I have to. But, quite alright. They could sit next to all the dead people. Um, here we go. Make some space for ourselves. Kind of ensure that we have enough space for everything. Uh, so, definitely get it kind of elevated. Why can't I elevate this? Hmm. Huh. Wait, no. Huh. I don't get it. I should be able to elevate this. I just don't see why it's not letting me actually do it. I mean... T... Oh. <laughs> well, I don't even know how to elevate my own freaking uh, roads. I thought it was uh, G on my keyboard and H and stuff like that. There. Huh. H, G, J, I don't know, what the hell, I don't know what's going on here guys, but, you know, I'm not really going to even bother with it anymore, so, that being said, we're going to have to fix everything that we just basically ruined, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, alright, well, that didn't work out as planned, but, you know, it's quite alright. Oh, well, these guys, though. These freaking guys. They are backed up. God damn. Let me see how many of these people are really uh, just going onto the bridge. Because if, if a lot of these guys are even going to the bridge, then... Uh, oh, yeah. Some of these guys, they kind of are going to the bridge. I was going to say that I could build a uh, little roadway. I could build an, an on-ramp to the highway on the Gray Bridge. Um, but anyway, seems like... I'm not entirely sure. Oh, these guys have a freaking uh, red light again because freaking... What do you want to call it? Here we go. Give them what they need. Hey, you know what? We'll, we'll, we'll just leave them with the damn light. Anyway... We need to really make some progress here, guys. Um, these guys over here, they don't have their damn water. So, they feel the need to sit here and uh, look like a bunch of clowns who don't get their water. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, a bunch of clowns don't get their water. Anywho. Get our water down there. We are going to bring it over there to where we're going to put the incineration plant, which I definitely forgot about. Um, right over here. Get our incineration plant. Kind of maybe... Uh, you know what? We'll leave it right over here and we'll make this all commercial. We'll make it all commercial. And we're going to bring in some, uh, some residential over here so that way it's kind of away from the... Uh, kind of away from everything. Away from the incineration plant, at least. It's gonna ruin the hell out of the, uh, out of the area, though. I will say that. Um, seems like we're gonna start actually meeting a need for uh, more offices and shit. So, it's actually, you know what, now that I think about it, instead of offices, wouldn't it be nice to have, like, a little rural uh, setting over here? I think that would be nice. I mean, over here in Newfoundland, uh, because who knows what's over in Newfoundland. 
Uh, there could be, you know, settlers from another fucking dimension that are just growing their crops in peace. Uh, who knows? So, so, with that being said, um, probably get a road. Going over here, we're gonna definitely get some industrial over here for Newfoundland. Uh, there we go. Let's get the little brush out. There we go. Alright. And then we're going to have some nice industrial up against the area there. And all these people want their shit. So let's give them their shit. Literally with the freaking garbage and the... No, that would actually be water and sewage. Yeah. I figured this was just water supply, but no, yeah, no. It... Well, I mean, I kind of knew that it... Uh, it did something with the sewage treatment, but, you know, it... Yeah. Anyway. Get ourselves our education, our nighttime education. For all those insubordin ins yeah, insubordinate ass kids. Alright. We got our shit. So we got all this industrial going. Of course, this is all, like, dirty industrial, so... We are going to have to kind of create more. We're going to have to kind of bring the district down here a little bit. Actually, it was fine for the most part. But um, we are going to turn the industrial in here into possibly, possibly a farmland or something. Maybe an ore industry. If not, maybe a, a far forestry um, hmm. I guess natural resource forest required natural resources what does it look like over here so we got do we have forestry barely I mean we got a little bit up there but you know we don't have shit uh, do we have ore I mean it doesn't really help when shit's in the way we got fertile land um, Anyway, let's see here. Oil or farming. Let's just do let's just do farming for now. I think we should just do farming. Look at the little transformation that's gonna start happening. Of course, I don't think any of these guys, you know, they're gonna like what they're about to see, you know. At least what it was a few seconds ago with all these, you know, oil pumping freaking things. It's probably one way to get rid of the terrorists. Um Maybe, you know, with all the pumping uh, oil and shit, pumping toxic gases and stuff, that's probably what creates the, uh, the sleeper cells. Who knows? Um, what the hell is going on here? There was like a tiny traffic jam because of a freaking thing at the lake residence. But, I don't know. I don't know what the hell is going on with these people. Long line of people going on over here. Don't know what's going on. I never know what's going on. Uh, let's see here. We do have more room for residentials, so we are going to give them just a little more residential before we wrap up the episode. I always have to deal with this little freaking uh, tax bullshit, this budget bullshit, and thankfully none of the loan bullshit. Because uh, we're sitting at over 2.7 million. We currently have 70,000 people. almost said 70 million. For God knows whatever reason. Um, so we're going to bring the road out here a bit. And by a bit, I mean a lot. And uh, we're definitely going to put a street out there. You know what? No. No. Just want to freaking delete the street. What is it having me delete exactly? Like, I, I just. There we go. Just let me delete the street. Uh, whatever. You know what? We'll, we'll, we'll keep it a, We'll keep it the way it is. Probably. Or not. Anyway. <laughs> I know. It, it, it was really stupid, guys. I know. Uh, but. 
got ourselves some roads out here. Definitely. Oh, well, that's going to be like that. It'll be fine. Kind of stretch it out like that. Um, here we go. Then we'll get like a nice boardwalk or something going on down here. For all those... Oh, man. This is going to look really choppy. This is going to look really stupid. Well, not much I can really do now. Um, let's see if it'll... See, I don't get that. It won't let me do anything. Like, I used to be able to just delete roads like it was nothing. I don't get it. I really don't get it. Well, I guess, you know, if these guys want to, you know, they want to live on downhill slopes and they want to, you know, yeah, they want to reap the, the, uh, the benefits of uh, living near industrial zones, which, of course, isn't really a bad thing because, of course, it's not really, you know, industrial at this point. It's just farming area. So, get some commercial zoning there. There we go. We got ourselves a little farming area out here. We got some, you know, futuristic farmers. Amy's Baking Company. I feel like that's an actual place in, like, New York or Jersey, though. I'm not entirely sure. Um, they, they usually, like, sit there and curse out their customers and shit. Um, I think Gordon Ramsay actually visited them uh, one time to actually, like, criticize their business, or at least critique their business. I don't even know what the hell he did, but, you know, he did something. Uh, slick fucker was doing something. We all know that. Because he's motherfucking Gordon Ramsay, people. Gotta admit, you know. But anyway, you know. Whoever the hell Amy's Baking Company is. Yeah. They better watch out. Because we got New One Greatville watching them. And if I don't like them, they get in the boot. Everyone gonna get the boot. So it seems like we have no demand. Oh, well, we just got a low demand for uh, industrial or offices. Uh, but seems like we're all good right now. So I think it is time to possibly quickly just add maybe a park. What is this? This is a large player, right? Yeah, this is a large. It's nice and large, if you know what I mean. There we go. We got ourselves a playground. Kind of took out a few houses. Fortunately, unfortunately, people had to leave and move out because of, uh, of uh, people that wanted to just have a playground to play on. Uh, we're going to get these guys a nice bouncy house. Make this one of the uh, tourist attractions. Nice little bouncy house. Um, here we go. Definitely get these guys something over here. Maybe a nice little Japanese garden. There we are. And it's going to look really weird. Not too weird, but, you know, it's still going to look really weird. Why, you know, the water hasn't, you know, overflown yet, drained out most of the way. And why the benches are just kind of sitting on basically cliffs. So, I guess you could say that's a real cliffhanger there. But, yeah, no, I'm not funny. I, I, I already knew I'm not funny, guys. Don't worry. So, uh... These guys don't really have enough goods to sell, even though they're right next to the industrial zones. Uh, these guys, they don't have enough of anything. But we're going to get to them soon enough. Get them in a, uh, an elementary school next to the incineration plant. Yeah, that'll smell good. Anyway, let's get just one last playground over here a bit. Here we go. There we are. Now that should help. Alright, so now, with that being said, yep. Alright, so guys, god, look how beautiful this city is at night. Alright, well, it's it would be even more beautiful if I had freaking electricity and shit. Here we go. You know what, I'll fix, I'll fix the rest later. I'll fix the rest later. So, there we go. So with that being said, if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment, subscribe for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching.